Or you remember what the Apostle Paul tells us in Romans 6.23. He says, the wages of sin is death. Well, that's awful harsh. We don't get to set the rules. We're not God. And what sin earns, the wages of sin, what sin earns is death, which is separation from God. But the free gift of God is eternal life through Christ Jesus our Lord. Why did Jesus have to die? Because we sinned. And to pay that price, somebody's got to die. And that's harsh. But that's the way it is. Our broken relationship, God fixed it. He fixed what we broke but couldn't fix because that's what he wanted to do. That's how much he loves us. That is why we celebrate. In Romans chapter 3, the Apostle Paul says, Yet God in his grace freely makes us right in his sight. Do we earn the ability to be right in his sight? No, we can't, because not a person that's ever been alive has been perfect. But God freely makes us right in his sight. He did this through Christ Jesus when he freed us from the penalty for our sin. What Jesus was doing was paying the penalty we had incurred through our sin. We just wanted him to fix our circumstances. God had much bigger plans. Goes on in verse 25. For God presented Jesus as the sacrifice for sin. People are made right with God when they believe that Jesus sacrificed his life, shedding his blood. We can't make ourselves right with God. But if we accept the fact that Jesus did it for us, that makes us right with God. That's what we're celebrating today on Easter Sunday. The lengths that God went to the price that God paid, the love God expressed when Jesus, God the Son, made it possible for us again to be with God, God the Father, and have God, God the Spirit, live inside of us. That's why we celebrate Easter every year. 